foot. All right, let's welcome some members to the, the live show today. We have Jill, we have Marcia, we have Jockey Mom, we have Lockett. Hi, Lockett. Magdalene is here also. Nazi, I haven't seen Nazi for a while. Welcome, Nazi. And we also have Karen Lumpkin. Lumpkin. Kin, K I N. Welcome to the live show. Now, if you're new here, hi Jill. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Brooklyn, New York is also here. Hi, Sherry. Welcome, welcome, welcome back. Now, if you are new here, it is Sunday chit chat. So we normally just chit chat. So go ahead and tell me where you're watching from. And also go ahead and start to comment. Now, the secret is out. How to clear dark. Okay, so that didn't get changed. I could see it didn't change on my end. How to clear dark circles, reduce wrinkles, dark spots, large pores. We're just going to chit chat about skincare. And while we're chit chatting about skincare, we're also going to take some questions and, you know, answer from you. So if you are here for the first time, go ahead and comment so that we can actually give you your shout out. I'm still waiting for people to tell me how their week was going. So we have Ta Tahiti. Uh, did I say that right? Um, Tahia. Tahia, welcome to the live show. We have Carlene Nesbeth, welcome. And who else is here? Kisha Walker, watching from Pasadena, California. Welcome, welcome, welcome. So what is your skin concern? That's what we're going to talk about. We're going to take question. Hi, auntie. Welcome. Linda A is also here. If you know anything about Sunday Chit Chat, you know that's what we do. We just chit chat. And it is Carlene first time. So I'm going to ask you the first question, Carlene. What is your skin concern? What is one thing that is going on with your skin that you wish that you could change? We also have um, Adiku, Adi Oki watching from Log um, Logos, Nigeria. Welcome to the live show. Chicago is in the house and my week has been great. That's from Karen. Really good to know. Marcia, you're watching from Canada and you had a good week. Huh. And um, funny, a lot of you have a good week. I guess mine was the only one. Well, it's not that my week was bad. It's just that it was raining all week long. So go ahead and tell me your skin concern and also Quick comment, if you're new here, you might not be aware that we have launched the Chichi Beauty skincare products. If you look all around me, you're going to see our products all over in this room. And um, we have our website that you can buy our products on, and that is alexmaxi.com. Let me put it up for those of you who are new. However, today it's all about the skin and we're going to take question and share some tips. So there it is, alexmaxi.com, if you're interested in any of our products. So let me ask you all, what is your skin concern? Jill had a great week out there in Arizona. Does it really rain much in Arizona, Jill? Go ahead and comment and let me know because I know it's a very, very hot out there. And is it hot uh, most of the year or is this like cool in the winter months? Go ahead and let me know that. So let me show you something really, really quick before we continue to start talking about the skin. If you have not tried our black rice, um, biotin, protein, and shampoo conditioner, fully back in stock, and there they are. It is a, a shampoo and a conditioner, and they are rich in protein, rich in biotin, and the base is black rice, which is great for your hair. On our website, you can pick these up for 40 $48, but today we're giving you the discount of 12 and you can use the code 12 in all cap and you'll get 12% off. They are 17.6 ounces um, for both and the shampoo, um, the shampoo, you can use it to wash your ear, the entire family, regardless if you have gray hair, regardless if you have color treated hair, if you have thinning hair, this is your girl right here. This is going to have to get rid of dandruff. It's going to have to get rid of split ends. It's going to have to regrow those ball spots. And it's also have your hair to be manageable. The conditioner is the same. It's a conditioner that you can use in your hair, rub it up, rinse it out, or you can choose to leave it in your hair for 30 minutes or longer, and then you rinse it out. So it's a treatment conditioner, and they are good for the entire family. So if you're looking for a new shampoo or conditioner, or if you just want to support us, go ahead and grab 
your shampoo and conditioner it is one of our five well it's the only shampoo and conditioner that we have on our website and people have been loving this so we can't keep them in stock so if you want to try today's a good day to try so let's go on and continue with the skin very little in my neck of the woods 82 for oh 82 degree right now oh my goodness just so i guess you were really <laughs> having a good time. New York, as I said, was washing away. So let's go ahead, guys, and let me hear about your skin. What is going on with the skin? We're going to give you some tips on the skin. If you are looking for, if you're new, first of all, if you're new and you do not know how to layer products on the skin, we can actually help you to layer the products on the skin and how to know. So these tips are what's going to keep your skin looking healthy. Now, how many of you have been steaming your skin? If you have been steaming your face, go ahead and comment, 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 because that is a vital tip for younger looking skin and why am i saying steam in your face is a, a a vital tip it's a vital tip because when you steam your face it open up those pores and everyone in case you don't know your entire skin is all pores and when the grease and the dirt and the dead skin cells that you shed from your skin fall into your pores, then it clogs those pores. So when you want your pores to be totally clean, go ahead and steam your face. That is tip number one for healthy looking skin. Tip number one for bright glowing skin. Now, when you steam your face, it is always good to exfoliate the face while you're steaming the face. What is this great exfoliating about? It is about taking a wash rug or any um beauty products that contain some form of a granule whatever it is a soft finely milled granules like our our facial polishes or it is a more coarser granules you use it and you exfoliate that face and two to three times per week is best now why are you exfoliating again because you're getting rid of the dead skin cells you're cleaning out those pores how many of you here watching struggle with large pores now what are, do we call large pores large pores are when the pores are filled with the grease and the dirt and you can actually take your eyes and look at them that's what you find on people face with a lot of holes and they have a lot of videos and YouTube, where they're showing people like extracting blackheads and all that grease out of those pores, that is what caused your pores to be enlarged, the grease and the dirt. And if you watch some of those videos, you're going to notice that when they squeeze them, you're getting that first come the black mess, then comes the thing that look like fat in the bottom because that is the grease. You don't want that on your face. You want to get rid of it. You want to get it out of those pores. And steaming is one of the easiest way. Now, if you get to the stage where those pores are really large and you can see that blackness and that round hole right there, then yes, you can turn to the professionals and they can use just like you see on the youtube videos where they take that little needle and they jam it right in there and then they squeeze it out and get out all of that believe it or not all of that is dead skin cells you can avoid that if you steam your face on a regular and even if yours is not that bad you still can avoid that you know extra blackheads and whiteheads that you're squeezing out by steaming the face steam the face and exfoliate the face together two to three times a week and that is gonna have that's gonna that's gonna be like a game changer believe it or not a game changer now what can you use and someone was asking the question earlier this week like i am so interested in getting in the habit of steaming my face however i do not have a steamer now you don't have that is one easy 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 facial care that you do not have to spend a lot of money on because all you need is a kettle and i like to talk about the kettle a lot because i feel like old school old school is when you know you put that 
pot of water on, you take that towel, you put it over your head and you um, let that steam hit your face. I, that is old school and that method has been using for centuries to steam the face, just to say how long people have been steaming the face. How many of you know that when people go get a facial, is the base of that facial that they go to get is steaming? How many of you know that? Do you know that normally people are like, oh, I got to go get a facial. When you go get a facial, do you know what they do? They steam your face. The difference is that you're laying back and sometimes they have this steamer like with a wand that they could, you know, put over your face like that because they have, you know, the co commercial, um, the commercial facial steamer. So that is the base. So after they steam your face, if you have like blackheads and whiteheads and these kind of things, then they would use that little gadget that they use and they would extract all of that. That's when you just start taking care of your skin. Lo and behold, I think I went and I got myself a facial and don't laugh now, don't laugh now. Um, it's over a year. Probably longer than a year. But anyway, yes, 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 yes. I do my own facial, okay? So, but yes, I went and I got, went to get myself a facial. And after they finished steaming my face and all of that, normally they want to recommend something for your face. And then she was looking at my face and she was like, your face is actually looking good. And I was like, yeah. In my mind, you know, like, yes, yes, yes. She said, your skin is good. So I didn't have to get that, you know, where they take out all those things out of your face. So I'm here to tell you that if you practice to steam your face for yourself, you're doing your skin justice. So as I was saying about the old time method with that cloth over the head and the pot, now I reinvent that. And I think it's okay to reinvent it. I think the kettle method is good. When I say I think the kettle method is good, it is good. I know that not everyone have a kettle that you put on the stove top. However, how many of you think that you should really have one of those in your kitchen? A lot of people do use the electric kettle. Now, I really don't know about the electric kettle. Like, I think the steam do come up too. I have not used one, even though I do have electric kettles, but I am a girl that like to put my kettle on the stove top. Something about putting the kettle on the stove top, do it for me. So I just like to have that a physical kettle, um, the plugging in, in and, you know, wait, no, I just like a kettle on the stove top. So when I put my kettle on, and if you have one of those kettles, and as a matter of fact, even if you don't have a kettle, well, when you compare the price of a kettle to the price of a, uh, a facial steamer, here, here is my truth to that. And I'm trying to see if I have my facial steamer anywhere near, since I normally have it pretty close to my decks here. But anyway, the, the truth is, if you're going to buy like a, um, a, a, a fairly priced kettle, a fairly priced kettle, you're going to probably pay the same amount as a fairly priced facial steamer. Bear with me. However, the facial steamer, you can only use it to steam your face. The kettle, you can have it in your kitchen and you can use it to do whatever it is that you want to do. So um, DV plays, that how you pronounce it, P-L-A-Y-Z. Welcome, welcome, hi, how are you? So yes, yeah, so if you have a little old kettle, you can use it to steam your face because it is the same as the steamer. The steamer is sending out that steam on your face. And if you put the kettle on, when your kettle is boiling up, it is sending out that steam. The thing is, the steamer steam is more controlled, meaning that the facial steamer is designed to send out steam just enough for it not to, you know, cause any form of an irritation on the skin or to burn your skin that is while when you're hi key welcome welcome while when you're using the kettle it's just gonna pour out the amount of steam that depending on the flame that you have under it the higher the flame is the more the steam is coming out so what you have to do just step back a little and rotate your face in that steam rotate 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 and you get yourself a very very good facial steam right there using that kettle method Personally, I prefer to use my kettle than my facial steamer. 
I get more steam for some reason. And I know some of you might be, maybe it's because of your steam or, or whatever, but no, I feel like I get more steam from the kettle. I get a better steam. It's almost like a more professional steam so, so from the kettle. So if you're not steaming your face, try to start steaming because that is going to lay the foundation. That is going to get rid of the grease, the dirt from the skin, get rid of the bacteria from the skin because if you're out there and you have acne on the skin all of that combined when you get where you know you find those people with the pus in it and all of that that is bacteria right there so practice to steam the face not only that if you are living somewhere where well let me not even say if you're living somewhere where is the, the weather is changing to get um a little colder you all know that nowadays there the word covid it's still going around it's still going around still going around so i suggest that during this time of the year when it, the virus tend to be um springing up back practice to steam the face too because when you're steaming the face you're also steaming their nose and that is also helping to get rid of all that um bacteria that might be anywhere on your face so that is the foundation for your skin to start to look better than it is currently looking. So how many of you are still steaming? And if you're new here and you have never steamed your face, comment, comment. And if you're just watching while the show is over, go ahead and still comment. Let me know um, if you have never ever steamed your face before. Really interested in knowing that. So just before we continue with more facial tips for younger looking skin, if you're interested in our facial polishes you can use this when you're steaming your face and if you go on our website you're going to find them these are the facial polishes that comes in a different flavors and they have to exfoliate they have to keep your skin get rid of the dead skin cell and just keep your skin looking bright and radiant we have the coconut and this is it right here facial polish this is the strongest one we also have uh, the vitamin c and vitamin c help to clear hyperpigmentation vitamin c have to reduce wrinkles and fine lines we also have the turmeric and the turmeric have to lighten brighten and also clear dead skin cells from the surface of the skin last week someone reprimanded me like in the comment like oh you take too long on the products get on with it and what is the price like you need to say talk about the price more so these are i think these are 22 dollars and today if you no 24.99 is the price for these facial polishes and today if you go on our website you can get them for 12 percent off use the code 12 which is going to be in all cap and get them home. So 12% off, $24.99. All of these are the same price. And we also have the carrot right here. And we do have real carrot juice in that. And we also have the aloe vera. So if you're looking to steam your face and you're looking for something new to try, something that works really, really well with steaming the face, try the Chichi Beauty facial polishes so aloe vera and take a look at that you can see all those amazing micro beads in this facial polishes when you polish your face with them they, these beads just burst on the skin and leave your skin with a natural glow they're very very addictive and they're not rough like you know so when you polish your face it just leave your face just feeling cool feeling soft and give you that glow so we have the aloe vera that you can try and we also have the carrot and this is it right here 24.99 for these and you can pick up any one of these today or pick up any two and use the code 12 for 12 percent a discount this is the vitamin c and we also have the very popular turmeric we also have the coconut and we also have the uh, blueberry. The blueberry is the softest one of all. However, when you do use the blueberry and you apply it on the face, you can feel that heat. Now, some customer, a customer of mine purchased um, one of our facial polish and she was complaining that when she used the facial polish, she feel a light heat 
on her face. And yes, as I said, that is it. It's a new technology. The, the micro beads in this are so fine that when you apply them on the face, you do not feel that coarseness on it, except for like the turmeric and the coconut and the vitamin C, you're going to find, you could feel those granules, but the rest of them, it's so finely milled when you apply it on the face, it's almost like you're using a facial wash on the face, a facial cream wash on the face. However, the granules are there, and when they burst on the face, they create some form of a warmth to the face, and that is what is giving your face that extra, 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 extra extra dose of, of 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 treatment to the skin to help to get rid of the the um the blackhead the grease the dirt from the skin can the polish be used after using a regular exfoliator yes you can use it after a regular exfoliator but you really do not need to because they are as i said so deceiving so deceiving and if you're used to a a polish that is really really rough like our sugar scrub and these form of a scrub when you use these on your face you might well some of them not all of them let's say the blueberry which is the mildest one when you use it on the face you might feel like oh i'm not getting that kind of exfoliating that i need but yes you are it's just because the grains are so fine like this one that i'm using now is the blueberry and i'm kind of surprised to see that I'm feeling the grains like that. The granules are right there. So when you apply it on the skin, polish your skin with it. It's a facial polish. Polish your skin for about two to three minutes, not two to three minutes, about a minute or so, just the amount of time that you would normally use your regular facial polish. And then when you're done, you just rinse that off. And oh, amazing. And yes, if you feel a slight a warmth to the skin, these are designed like that. To help to further it's a cross between a facial a facial peel and a facial exfoliator there's nothing to peel up but that warmness is what is waking that skin up sr i love the blueberry and aloe vera polish i can't stop touching my face after my entire product process thank you so much for creating and you are so welcome and like for me i also i just can't get enough of these facial polishes and i find myself like when you get it at home use it and give it a time to work okay give it time to work when you use it the first time if you're used to a regular facial scrub you're gonna be like mm, well it depends on which one because if you use the coconut and the 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 um the vitamin c and us like now when i rub this on my hand now i could feel that sensation because I over rub it on my hands. Do not do that even though they're so um, they're so soft. What happened? Take for instance, you take sugar and you grind that sugar out to basic to a powder like. It is still in there. That is what these are. The granules are there, but because they're so finely milled, you cannot feel them like rough on your face. But the more you use them, is the more you're gonna find out that you are like. Oh, wait a minute. As every time you go wash your face, you just feel like you want to reach for them because that's when it starts to really work on the skin. So choose whichever you want, $24.99. Use that code 12 and get $12 off. So how do you use this to um, exfoliate while steaming? You put that steamer on. If you have a physical steamer, you put the steamer on, you let the steamer hit your face, you take a little bit of the, the polish and you start to exfoliate while the steam is hitting your face. And even if you're using your kettle, you can do it like that. However, if you don't have any of those methods and you have to do, you know, the regular whole one where you put your head over the hot water, then steam the face and as soon as you're done with the steaming grab any of the ex the polisher and wash your polish your face with it and just feel the skin you are good to go so that's one tip now the next tip is how many of you are still how many of you are still massaging the face how also oh, um carleen you have never steamed now you're gonna try it and we have an entire video in our in our um 25 day skincare challenge where we show you how to steam your face we even do a live demonstration 
showing you how to steam the face. When you're done calling, you can just look under this video. You're going to see the link to the 25 Day Skincare Challenge. And you can just go through the topics because you'll find the video that we do that. We show all method in that video. So how many of you are still still massaging the face? If you're massaging your face, comment, comment, comment. That is another thing that you need to do. It doesn't matter how many beauty products that you purchase for your skin. You could purchase a beauty product for $10. You could purchase a beauty products for $200. You could purchase one for $500. And yes, I am not crazy when I'm saying that. That is the price of beauty products these days. Like real expensive, okay? Hundred. The first time I saw a facial cream for five hundred dollars, I was like shocked. And you want to see me? First thing I'm doing is looking at the ingredients. Like I want to know what is in this because five hundred dollars. What? Oh, whoa, whoa. But if you if you know ingredients are very very well, then you'll know that most of the time you're paying for the name of it or something like that. We try to make sure that you get ingredients that is going to work on the skin in our product. So let's talk about a facial massage. Tomorrow morning, I'm going to share a video with you on the channel. I made a, a facial oil blend. And remember when we used to make those, we make like a lot of videos we're making those facial oil blend and we normally use other people oil to make it but the one i'm going to share tomorrow we use some of our oils to make that facial oil blend and apart from our turmeric facial oil blend we do not have a blend like the chichi beauty facial oil blend in our shop i am actually thinking about getting my anti-aging oil blend which i will take a very popular recipe from our youtube page and turn that into the anti-aging blend but we have one for you coming up in the form of a video tomorrow so make sure to watch that video and make sure to share the video so back to a facial massage when do you massage your face you massage your face every day every day if you can you massage your face that is like eating if you're taking care of your skin and you are trying for your skin to look good, you massage it every day. Now, you can also choose to massage your face, put a little extra effort into massaging your face, face for at least uh, 15 to 20 minutes, at least once per week. Now, how can you massage your face every day? You massage your face with the shortcut, Hello, Evelyn. Um, this, do you pronounce your name Evelyn or Evelyn Williams? Welcome. And we have Lockett. I, I did answer the question. Hi, Ilma, still massaging. Marcia, do Jill never stop. Um, and Cheryl, I massage every night and it makes a huge difference. And yes, yeah. What time tomorrow that I'm going to post? I am going to try to start back posting um, at 7 p.m., not 7 p.m., 7 a.m. every day it is october welcome october guys it is october and quick announcement we are going to be posting a video every day in the month of october it is called like october fest or some some something like that and youtube never do it before but this month i'm going to be doing it so as of today all the way to the end of, of october every day at 7 p.m 7 a.m 7 a.m we're gonna have a video it's gonna be a mix it's because i'm trying to please you know the, the the subscribers of the channel channel so we're gonna have some diy we're gonna have some other videos talking about ingredients and stuff like that but every day for the month of october so set your clock or even if you don't get the notification as most people are not getting the notification since we have not been posting like that so we're going to get back into the mood of posting so come on the channel page every day 7 p.m 7 a.m a.m early morning in america well midday in england 7 a.m every morning we're going to be posting and we're still going to have some evening show now everyone is begging for the 25 days skincare challenge so if we're going to start that back it's going to be after way in the end of october because we have some you know some some 
things that I have to do in the month of October, which would hinder me from doing the 25 day skincare challenge and be present every day for it. So after October, then we'll go back into that 25 days skincare challenge. So what about microcurrent facial? Microcurrent and facial, if you're new here, you might not know we do feature some microcurrent devices on our channel page before. And I'm looking to see if I even have one of those microcurrent device um, close by me. Now, nothing is wrong with doing that. We support you using any device on your face. Any device that is gonna help to enhance your skin, go ahead and use it. And we do endorse them on our page right here. Like, you know, um, we did a video and I probably will, um, and this is one that we have. We actually have two of these. Um, these are sponsorship that we get um, months ago and we still have the gadget here and I still use them, to be honest. I kind of not find the time to, um, to, to, to use them as often as I would like to. So whenever I get the time, I still try to do a little microcurrent on my face. I know Jill also have one of this device. So any form of a tool or electrical gadget that you can use to enhance in terms of massaging your face, go ahead and use it. All those spin brushes that they have out there, go ahead and use it. If you have one of those spin brushes, or take for instance this one here this one i got like years and not years and years ago like you know when i just started my youtube channel i got this one here it was for a promotion and i love it so i used to give away these um to my subscribers how many of you remember these how many of you have one of these years ago we give them away i still have mine so if you have like your sprint spin brush like this and you're going to use them to wash your face don't know if this one is charged let's see oh yes very much charge you go ahead and you put your put your facial cleanser on the brush and then you use it to wash your face go ahead so use any of these things that is out there if you have them use them up with your skincare products you might not know how to use them and if you're interested we're going to come on we'll make a video since we're looking for a lot of ideas for the month of October and we'll make these videos for you to show you how to use but massage 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 now is this helping to massage your face yes it's also helping to massage your face less better full speed and this one is a really really good massager so yes go ahead and try them if you have them and just use and if you're curious about the facial foam wash that I just sprayed on my my little egg cleanser this is it right here and i'm telling you guys i am telling you you all need to try this cleanser oh my goodness you all need to try this cleanser take a look at it it's brown it's different from our other anti-aging foam cleanser the other anti-aging foam cleanser this is it right here and this one is not open they're different this one comes in this box right here it's pretty new we did a soft launch for this one and i think most of you overlook it but this is it right here i just cannot get enough of this cleanser it is called our luxurious clarifying cleansing mousse and it is rich in so many amazing ingredients for your skin so you can check it out i think it's 25 dollars for it and if you use the code 17 you get it home for that's 17, 12, you get it on for 12% off. And take a look, it's like that. And it's a little goes a long way, two pump on the skin and you're good to go. So back to facial massage. Now, you massage your face with a facial oil. That's how I start telling you all about that oil blend. SR, I love the foam cleanser. I've been using it for about a week. I use it as part of my morning routine. Yes. And those official the foam cleanser there is a must try. Any one of you, hi Georgia, welcome to the live. Any one of you that want to try and have not yet, try, tr try, just try. Get it in your collection. It's really good. So to massage your face if you are massaging your face in the week like you're really really doing it quick 
go ahead and use your facial moisturizer to massage your face. Now, whenever you are going to give your face that full massage, that full 15 or 20 minutes massage, massage it with a facial oil. Okay, massage it with a facial oil. A facial oil is best to massage the skin when you are going to really massage your face. However, for a quick facial massage at night, use your facial cream to massage your face. So you're going to spritz your face with your facial toner. Once you spritz that toner on the face, then you're going to go ahead, you're going to put your facial serum on the face. You press the serum in the skin. And then you're going to use your facial moisturizer. Once you apply that facial moisturizer on your face, and this is our vitamin C cream, if you're interested in that. Once you apply the facial moisturizer on your face, then go ahead and massage. You can press it on. I personally like to press my moisturizer on my face, press it on, and then go ahead and take your fingers or if you have a little gadget and massage your face. Just massage it every day, a.m. and p.m. now, because you're doing this little quickie massage, you don't have to spend 10, 15 minutes massaging your face, you know, in the week or so, but at least once per week or find that day when you're going to really massage your face. If you don't know massaging technique, watch a video. We have some on the channel page. We're going to bring a new one this month since we really got to get those content out. So we are going to bring some more facial massage for you. So you massage your face and that is the time when you need that facial oil. Now you can use any one oil. So this is the video this is the oil for the video that I'm going to post tomorrow. It's an oil blend and it's a perfect anti-aging oil. You can make your own oil blend as your facial massage or you can use standalone oil. For instance, if you visit our website, you can see we have a collection of oils. We have like the pomegranate seed oil. We have the aloe vera oil, we have the papaya oil, we have the rose seed oil, we have the um, coconut oil, we have grape seed oil, we have apricot oil, and I'm sure I'm missing some star anise oil, um, rosemary essential oil, and tea tree oil. So you can get all these oil on alexmaxi.com. And for instance, our grape seed oil is a fifteen dollars. So either 15 or 14 dollars i think it's 15 dollars so and it is 3.38 ounces if you want to get it today you can grab it and you can get 17 percent off 17 not 17 12 percent off all your orders except for some packages that we have if you buy over 180 dollars then you get 25 dollars off and there's one set that we have I think it's one of our AM and PM 8P set. If you pick that up, you get $35 off. So check out our website and go on the bundle and save and search for those amazing discount that we have going on for the month of, of October. So pomegranate oil and aloe vera oil and papaya oil. All of these oils you can use on your skin as a standalone oil and also the apricot oil when you are massaging your skin. So go ahead and use just one oil and massage your face with it. Or if you're like me and you like that oil blend, then you go ahead and blend two or three oils together and make your own anti-aging facial oil so that you can use it on the skin. When do you use an oil on the skin if you're not massaging? Now, you can choose to use our anti-aging facial oil on the skin right after, right after you use your facial toner if you're just in the mood for oil. Now, if you are just doing your full facial routine, then the oil, one drop of this oil on top of your moisturizer. One drop of the oil on top of your moisturizer. So like I just put my vitamin C moisturizer on, then I will take my oil blend. And yes, I still make them and I still use them and I use them on top of my, my and that is it. One or two drops in your hands like that. You rub it like this 
and you press it over your facial moisturizer. That's how, especially if you're, you know, living where it's going, getting cold right now, where everything is just drying your skin out, then you need that extra um, oil barrier on their face. However, if you're too lazy to make the oil blend, then go ahead and just use any one oil on your face at night. If you have aloe vera oil, one drop over your face. If you have rosehip seed oil or pomegranate seed or papaya seed oil, one drop over your face but whatever you do massage 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 your face any question come in um how can i stop here from growing on my chin so i'm gonna answer that question now i'm nearly what is the best exfoliating towel to use on the body now the honest truth is i could not say what is the best one because they have some great one out there some people like to use the gloves, the gloves one, if that's what you're talking about, and, you know, exfoliate your body. I'm going to be honest with you. When I am exfoliating my skin, 90% of the time I'm using my hands. 90% of the time I'm using my hands. I do, however, have a brush that I can also, a big long one that can do all the back and all of that. Um, but I just find that, you know, I like a connection with the scrub and my hands and my skin. So I tend to do that. But if you like, like that wash rug, the, 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 the hand gloves with the exfoliating, um, thingy on the front, you can go ahead and use those to exfoliate the body. Or you can just use a simple wash rug. Some people don't know that you can use a simple wash rug. It's just that when you use the exfoliant on the wash rug, sometimes it leaves the rug greasy. You got to toss it, throw it in the washer or so on. But definitely, definitely use your hand or if you have a gadget, one of those long brush one. And I think we used to give away some of those too. You can pour your little um, facial polish on it and take it and do the back. Or if you have the gloves one, you put it on and you do that. They're out there. You can get a lot of those like on Amazon. All right. So years and years ago, not years and years ago, I am normally struggling with facial hair. I do struggle with facial hair. Never ever hide that. Never ever hide it. Now I've tried a lot of things. You name the gadget. I used to buy them for my facial hair. Now my experience is the one thing that I use on my facial hair that I see that really, really works is turmeric. And that is the truth. So I was making a lot of videos showing you how to use the turmeric to get rid of your facial hair. Now, how does this turmeric work on your facial hair? The turmeric works by inhibiting the hair growth, meaning that when you use it, it's going to take a while before you notice that the hair is coming back thinner and thinner and thinner. It is a process. If it was a situation where you could just use that turmeric and voila, the hair is gone, never ever come back, you know, then a lot of us would be like really, 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 really rich. But I like to keep it real with you. That turmeric works. Now we have our turmeric line of product and those are some of the videos while we decided that we were going to make our turmeric skincare products our base our base our base product on our website on the chichi beauty skincare line the turmeric set these are our base products we will always have the turmeric because those videos that we use turmeric is um were like some of our more viral videos and i personally use the turmeric on my chin area and i was seeing such amazing result that i myself could not believe that the turmeric worked like that not only that the turmeric also helped to lighten and brighten the skin that's another thing that i was skeptical about years and years ago until i decided to try turmeric for myself and when I tried the turmeric for myself, I was uh, blown away. No joke, like just blown away. Didn't know that turmeric could really work on the skin so fast. So ever since that, I am sold. There are two things that I tend to be sold on when it comes on to my DIY and me personally experiencing them for myself. One is that parsley leaf. I am really swear by parsley leaf for dark on the eye circle. And the next one is turmeric because this is where I see like result that I myself is like doing like this. 
this thing really works this thing really works and that's how we come up with our turmeric line of product if you have a facial hair out there on your face i would suggest that you try our turmeric products especially our turmeric mask okay and i let's see if i have a open one here so how i'm using i use my turmeric mask but i am telling you that you can go ahead and try this is the turmeric mask right here now let me be honest the turmeric mask is not as strong as if you get that turmeric powder that turmeric powder itself and make just that paste however you got to be careful because not everyone it, skin is going to tolerate the harshness of that turmeric of paste so here's a word of advice a try our turmeric mask go ahead and just put it on the chin area and give it six weeks why six weeks because that's so long you need to know if a product work under the skin use it on the face and all over your face and see if the hair is gonna take forever to go back so what you do to begin with is either you're gonna start out by doing it for the last time you're gonna start out by either tweezing plucking or shaving whatever you do to that area and then you're going to start to use the turmeric products on the face now i don't go around telling people that when you use the turmeric on the face it's going to let the hair fall off right away however the the my followers that use my turmeric line do testify that the turmeric not only is reducing the amount of hair on the face but it is also getting rid of warts and moles dark spots and blemishes on the skin so if you are looking for a facial ear removal try some turmeric or go ahead and do one of my diy just to start out with um for for the chin area and see what happened it is a problem it is a problem it is a problem but um you can control the excess ear on the skin so this is the turmeric and it comes with we have seven different pieces of turmeric product. We have our turmeric facial um, facial cleanser. We have our turmeric facial toner. We have the turmeric mask that I just showed. And we also have the turmeric cream that you can apply on the skin. And this is it right here. Now, if you look at our turmeric cream and you turn it around, you might think that, oh, the turmeric is white though. Yes, because you do have a white turmeric and you have the yellow turmeric. Personally, for me, for the skin, I prefer to use the white because it don't leave that excess stain and you get the same result as the yellow. However, the yellow is more popular, very, very popular out there. So some people, when they see the white, they're like, oh, not much turmeric is in there. But yes, this is white turmeric in the in this. So try the turmeric. And, and we use white turmeric powder on our um, in our DIY too. For years, we have been using both the yellow and the white turmeric on the page because I find that I do like the white turmeric because it don't leave a mess. Now, when you use the Chichi Beauty turmeric line, no, we take that guesswork out of it for you. We do not. It's not going to stain your sheet or anything like that. We have the turmeric um, facial polish also that you can try. We have the, the toner, the serum, the cream, the mask, the polish, and I probably forget something else, the cleanser. So we have all of that in turmeric. So this is the turmeric facial cream right here. Give it a go. Rub it on the area where you have your chin here, or if you have like all those sideburn coming down. So that is the turmeric cream right there, moisturizing cream. You apply it on your face, your chin area, all over your face. It's, it's a cream that you can use everywhere, okay? It's just that I'm just showing you how you can use it to help to inhibit the hair growth. And it gets to the shock of the hair and cause the hair to prevent the hair from growing back that fast. So anyone with facial hair that is looking for something to inhibit give the turmeric a try as i said it comes with the cream it comes with the facial um toner it comes with a facial oil a turmeric facial oil blend and it also comes with the serum and the cleanser and the and something else the mask that is all right so check that out any question if you're new here hi auntie 
welcome to the live that's alice day hi pauline welcome to the live show and who are hi juliana welcome marley lee is here also and if you're here and i didn't call your name because i don't see it in my view so let me scroll back any question you have go ahead and comment and as i i did call out georgia and any questions so we're just sharing some tips and go ahead and comment if you're new ask a question so we could answer you now guys and we have nine minutes more for the show if you're new here since we are at it showing our products take another look this is our anti-aging age renewal supreme set really becoming one of our fastest selling set and there goes a sheba barking so what is in this set this is our and this is 159 dollars for this set and you have six pieces i gotta remember my subscriber was like you gotta sell the price okay so it is 159 dollars for the set you get six pieces in it and not only that you get an extra 12 percent off the set today what do you get you get your facial cleanser you get your facial toner you get your facial serum you get your day cream you get your night cream you get your eye cream and what did i miss the cleanser so the cleanser is there so cleanser toner serum day cream night cream eye cream that's what you get six pieces this is the only set that we have that and it's 159 dollars and if you buy it today you get 12 percent off 12 percent off a hundred dollars is twelve dollars 12 percent off fifty dollars is six dollars so right there is eighteen dollars and what else is left the nine dollars so you get eighteen dollars and some cent off this so round it off to twenty dollars not twenty dollars eighteen something round it off thirty dollars so um so you get this for about $139 somewhere there when you apply the code 12 to this package. And if you had something else to your cart along with this package, if you have to add something to the cart with this, what would I recommend that you have? Since this is a full set, the only thing that is not in this set is a facial mask. A facial, no, two things that is not in this set, a facial mask and a facial scrub. So if you had a facial mask to it any facial mask we have a variety to the set then it could probably go 180 but you have to have a facial mask and something else to take it to 180 dollars and then you can get a easy peasy 25 dollars off anytime you put anything in your cart for over 180 dollars use that code 25. shara does the supreme set of collagen in both the day cream and the night cream yes 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 now let me talk a little bit really really quick this is the eye cream about the day cream and the night cream now this night cream is a jump pack the night cream is loaded with all the essential vitamins that you need for the skin and i still can't see anything the glare from the plastic over over the product however i know the ingredients so this have retinol it also have collagen it have vitamin c it have like squalene oil in this okay so this have some amazing and we do have potato starch in this set this is the set that we have the potato starch in for tightening and firming the skin so that's what you're going to find in the night cream the day cream does not have any form of a retinol in it it is way not way but it's a little lighter than the night cream this also have more oils in it more anti-aging oil than the day cream we make the day cream a pretty pretty light the day cream um i can't read a thing it do have a bit of a grapeseed oil it also have some collagen in it it also have um the potato that we just mentioned is also in here this have uh, okay so the first ingredient is water glycerin collagen of vitamin e it also have the squalene oil and um it have the potato starch which you're going to see that under potato 
pulps and it have hyaluronic acid in it also. So those are some of the ingredients that you're going to find in the day cream, while the night cream is going to have everything that is in this, plus some retinol and plus some other ingredients. So two different type of cream, a lighter cream and a heavier cream. Why do we make the nighttime one like that? Because you're going to put it on the skin and you're going to leave it on the skin. You're going to sleep with it. It spend a longer time on the skin so we can put the heavier oils, the heavier ingredients in it. The day one have to be light because you're going to be outside and you also might be, you know, in the sun. It's very, very good. If you cannot commit to the set, Go ahead, you can grab the day cream and the night cream together. You still get that 12% off, or you can get grab any three pieces from the set. If you're looking for a, a routine and you don't want to come into the Supreme set, but you want to use the Supreme product, I would suggest that you do this. You get the day cream, you get the night cream, and you grab the cleanser. And you grab the cleanser. Or you get the day cream, the night cream, and you grab the toner. This is a good set here. You would not have the serum, but you would be able to put the toner on. And then at night, you put your toner on, and then you put your facial night cream. In the daytime, you put your toner on, and then you go ahead and you put that day cream on. So that's an easy, easy easy way to have your AM and your PM going. And then you can use any other serum or you want to grab the serum along with that, that would make a complete three pieces, which is really four pieces if you're doing the day cream on the night cream. Or you can toss the day cream and go ahead and grab the night cream, the serum and the toner. And this make a great nighttime three piece set right here. The, 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 the serum, the toner, and the night cream. A great a three piece. So that is how you play around with the Supreme if you don't want to be committed to the full set. However, you get better value for your money if you do the full set of the Supreme. So that is my skincare products. And don't forget to support, 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 support. If you're new here and you have a question, go ahead and comment, comment. Yes, you know, these are really reading glasses, right? Yes, I tend to have reading glasses everywhere. I am, look at this, just addicted. So true story, I went to my ophthalmologist and he was like, um, you know, because I'm always on the computer, always on the computer. So he was like, you know, your eyes are good. So however, you can choose to, you know, just do the reading glasses if you want. 1.5, right? 1.5. Oh, my goodness. I just start going reading glasses crazy. <laughs> reading glasses crazy. So I start over with some little teeny tiny ones. And then I find that I can't find the reading glasses. I didn't know that reading glasses was like that, where you put it one place, then you're somewhere else, and then you can't find it. So. I just started get reading glasses and have them everywhere, <laughs> everywhere, 1.5. But then when I really want to look cute, no, the honest truth is like when I look on YouTube and, you know, some of those um, YouTubers that do the vlogging, they normally have these nice reading glasses. So I went in search for them. So see, I have a whole bunch of reading glasses. Now, here's the next problem. There are three reading glasses right here. We don't need three re reading glasses on the deck. But every time I'm coming in, I was like, oh, do I have the glasses? And then I um, would find myself having all the glasses one place. Still can't find the glasses. But yeah, those are reading glasses right there. Thank you for the comment. All right. Anyone else have a question? Oh, it is exactly one hour. If you want to shop today, go support your girl by picking up anything that you want in the store. Don't forget, we just recently launched the blueberry mask. So if you have not yet pick that up. It is there to try. This is it right here. You know, I go crazy over my own facial mask, right? I wish I could just use a mask every day. <laughs> no, no, no. It's the truth. It's like, I'm like a kid in a candy store when it comes on to my facial mask. 
I am so happy. I like the layout, layout. And believe it or not, I am that type of a person that who would, even if it wasn't mine, would buy the whole collection of facial masks because I'm crazy like that. I just like, and use all. So the blueberry is the newest one to the collection. And for those of you who have not seen the mask collection, we have the blueberry. We have, and that is a clay mask. We have the green tea. And this is the green tea. And this is a clay mask. Look at that. So we have the blueberry. And now you can see why, if you're like a girly girly, like you would understand why I go Google over these masks. So we have the blueberry, we have the green tea, which is good for anti-aging. We also have the fresh rose. And this is the fresh rose. And this is clay mask also. We have um, two mud masks. And mud mask is for those of you who are, who are, you know, struggling with dry skin, go ahead and try the mud mask. We have the turmeric one, which I just featured earlier. We also have the carrot and the two mud masks that we have is the bamboo. This mud mask here smells so good. The bamboo charcoal mud mask. And we also have the avocado mud mask. And this is the avocado mud mask right here. So if you're interested, grab a mask today any one and give it a try and it's very very soft the masks are very 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 soft okay so take a look this is the mud mask right here and that's the avocado mud mask and when you're going to use it i suggest you wash your face first someone always want to know do i wash my face first yes wash your face first and look at that this just go on like a cream that's what i like about these masks they goes on like a cream and once you apply the mask on your face, you try to find a time for the mask. You let the mask sit on your skin for at least 30 minutes. If you're short on time, 15 to 30 minutes is good. And once that is done, it's going to be dried. And then you just rinse it off. Use your mask two to three times per week on the face. Don't store up your mask, okay? Now, if you don't have the time to wait for the 30 minutes, then guess what you do try to put the mask on while you're doing other things so you put it on walk around you know if you have breakfast to make or you know whatever it is that you do at home and by the time you're ready to go eat the shower then the mask would have been dry and once the mask is dry you have to tighten and firm the skin lip tighten and firm the skin good to use a facial mask you know what i would like to to make i would like to make a mask with a little little bit of a mint in it like that give you that coolness and yes i started sweat didn't know i was gonna sweat today but it's coming but the show is over so that's okay i kind of make it to the end of the show today before it start to really pour <laughs> really 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 poor but it's um yeah, it's something I'm dealing with, boy. Yes, I am. But yes, check those masks out. And we remember, we are going to be posting a video every morning at 7 a.m. for the month of October. Uh, and this is the carrot mask, guys. That's the carrot mask right there. And check it out. This is our fastest selling mask and now the blueberry. And because most people, you cannot find this carrot mask anywhere. So a lot of people are you know, buying the carrot mask. And we also have the carrot polish. So we have it as a set on the website. So if you have not tried anything carrot before, check out both of these on our website. Now that's my time today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget, come and watch this week. And we're going to post a pretty, pretty early in the week what time we're going to be doing our live this week we're doing no repeat no repeat this week guys so come out and support the live shows this week definitely no repeat all live and then we're going to have our daily video for you know starting tomorrow morning at 7 p.m am we're posting the first video watch the video and share the video so that others will realize that we're back at it you know up and running again thank you so much for watching thank you jill for always always been here always supporting thank you all thank you everyone 
Don't forget to come back and watch our daily video. And don't forget to support by, you know, visiting our, our store. Tell people about the store and use the products and leave a comment. Come back and let us know if you're enjoying them. I love you all. And I'll see you all in my next video. I'm almost sure I'm going to be on live tomorrow. So I'm going to make the schedule and then um, I'll let you know. But definitely no repeat this week. So you can come and watch the live shows with us and also support by watching our daily posting thank you so much have a great weekend rest a weekend have a great week and have a great sunday morning sunday evening sunday afternoon whatever time it is where you're watching from be good to yourself love yourself and don't forget to take care of you because if you don't no one else is really going to do it for you